Okay, so we're gonna start now. Only seven questions. So the answer is very obvious to inform. Okay, so let's see who is. Wow, congratulations, Wadudu, whoever you are. Okay, Bernadette is catching up soon. Next. Wanting to ask your audience to have a different opinion about a topic, so your general purpose is normally to persuade them. Oh, Bernadette! Okay, Zunwe is also catching up. Next. This is something that I've been, you know, continue talking over and over again. Central idea. Please do not forget to include central idea in your first presentation as well. Just some sponsored notes. Oh my God. Tables to turn now. Zunwe is not on top. Okay, okay. Moving on. Okay, so specific purpose um, should be written in a full sentence, never a question. Okay, so moving on to see. Oh no, okay. Sin Hong is now on top. Okay, okay. Right. So with this um, statement here, something should be done about global warming. What is the something? So in central idea, as I mentioned, the best or the best is to include three points. So what are the three things that should be done? Uh, three things that should be done about global warming are one, two, and three. So you have to be specific about it. All right. Next. Okay, all right. Sing Hong is staying strong, but watch out for Xiu Ying here. Two more, two more guys, two more.
so residual message is the thing that you want your audience to remember. So after you end your speech, if people were to say, oh, did you listen to Miss Farah lecture yesterday? So what are the main points or what we call it as residual message that the audience will remember from a speech? Okay. Sing Hong is staying strong. Last one, guys. Not textbook, la, according to your slides. Okay, so it's definitely egocentrism. All right. Okay, so let's see who win. Woo! Third place, Yuman. Second place, Xiao Ying. And a winner today, Sing Hong. Congratulations. Congrats. Well done. Well done. Okay, so Sing Hong, please do um, contact me. Please do personal WhatsApp me in a bit. I shall be giving you some token of appreciation. So from last week's uh, winners, you guys will be getting um, something as well. I will be posting hopefully today with your prize, Sing Hong. Okay, so please do let me know in a bit. Well done. Woo! Okay, so for uh, the topic that I touched about in this um, Kahoot earlier was only from our class in week one. So it basically doesn't even do justice to cover everything in your test. Okay, so please do and study. Um, please do and make sure that you know the things and if you just want to refer for spelling and stuff like that, you can do it uh, during the test because after all, this is an open book test. Okay. All right. So good luck for your um, for your uh, test one next week. Please um, start revising. And uh, we don't have much things to do today because um, I showed you we have covered even more than what we should be covering for your test one. However, I will be here until 12 p.m. if you want um, to have a consultation. And I know that this morning, one of you emailed me. If you can stay so that I can give you the feedback in a bit, that will be great as well. The rest of you, um, if you want, you can go and continue doing your presentation one. If, is there any questions that you want to ask me? Congrats. Congrats, Sing Hong. Woohoo! So, any questions that you want to ask me, you can ask. You can stay. If not, you can leave. Thank you so much for joining me. Um, have a good rest. Do not stress. <laughs> I know that it's hard, but do not stress. Uh, please take care of your health. Okay? So, please stay if you have questions. And I think um, to the person who emailed me this morning, please stay as well. If you want me to, you know, ask me a consultation or you want to talk to me, please also stay. All right. Okay. Thank you. Sing Hong, don't forget to contact me. Yeah? Thank you. Take care. Is it okay sleep? Okay. Please have a good rest. Okay. Bye. Stop texting me at 4. Okay. Go to sleep. Go to sleep. Have a good rest. Take care. Um, if you want to ask questions, please stay. Okay. Bye. Hey, no, 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 no. Just kidding. Lah. Kidding. Bye-bye. Have a good rest, everyone. Bye, guys. Take care. Uh, who emailed me this morning? Huh?
Wait, I need to stop sharing first. <laughs> okay. Li Weilin, okay. Stay. Wei Shan asks, is it okay if the presentation is about 3 minutes and 3 seconds? So, it's okay for me, but after, I won't be listening to the remaining 3 seconds at the end. So, if your 3 seconds involves um, you to do an activity or stuff like that, I, I cannot consider it as... It's no problem with me, but I won't take anything after 3rd minute. Do you get what I mean? Miss, uh, wait, uh, which one did I answer your question? Yes, okay. Miss, test 1, section A is not multiple choice. No, no, no multiple choice, only short answer. So you have to type your answer. That is why your spelling needs to be perfect capitalization is okay okay thank you all right good luck you can study or you can go and uh you know do your presentation okay wait is this All right, if you have any question, please um, let me know. Just going to see some issue here with the recording in a bit. Wait, 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 wait. <clears throat> Let's see. Content. Week 3, right? Week 3. Okay, um, Jennifer, are you listening to me? Um, can you hear me from the teams or are you already outside of team? Okay, so if you cannot view it from here, you need to look at the um, recordings by clicking. Let me just make it easier. So this is your student preview. I'm just going to show you. So if you go to tools here, okay. So click on Blackboard Collaborate Ultra. Hey, oh, I didn't show you my haha. <laughs> Wait, uh, I'm just going to share you my. Okay, can you see? Uh, can you see? Can you see my screen now? So sorry, I was talking. <laughs> I forgot that I haven't shared my, um, my screen with you. Can you see this? Jennifer, can you see this? Okay. Uh, wait up. So sorry. Uh, wait up. Wait up. Uh, so Jennifer, I hope that you can see my screen. K. 
can you see my screen, Jennifer? Yes, Miss, I can see. Awesome. So here, this is your home page. Click on Tools. Um, after you're done clicking on Tools, click on Blackboard Collaborate Ultra. And then, just taking a bit some time. And then you click on this um, button with three lines, and then you will see recording here. So basically, it has all of the recordings that we've been having. Normally, I would download it and then upload it in a YouTube, my YouTube channel so that it's easier for you guys to view it. But you guys can do this as well. So you can just simply click on this and then you would be able to watch it. Okay? I would be able to see if you watch this as well. Oh. All right, I hope that is clear. Awesome. Oops. Okay, thank you for the question. Let me ask, uh, let me ask, who's, Miss, I saw some of my friends, some of the friends cut and join the video. Um, is that can or cannot? A bit confused for the presentation one. So basically, the idea of, uh, remember I told you guys, um, for your first presentation, it's not like a video that you do maybe in YouTube. I need you to present it. Okay? So it has to be like a whole presentation. So you're not, actually you're not supposed to cut and join. However, if you've done it, I just see it. If, if you cut it, it's not supposed to be done that way. Okay? If you have done it that way, um, please let me know. I'm just going to see how you present first. Because um, it should have only one cut, no editing. Because it's supposed to be a presentation, not like a video. On YouTube do you get what I mean I think I explained about this before but if you have cut and joined the video let me know so that I can see it if I see it and I say that uh, I might have to penalize on you on this because it's not fair for other people who is presenting for three minutes straight and there is a difference between uh, presenting for three minutes and also presenting for one minute one minute and then you cut it into one okay so please let me know so that I can see your presentation and then I can say like, uh, I'm so sorry, uh, I'm going to give you time to redo it um, if you want. Or if not, um, I, if I think that the cut and paste is okay and it's fair for your friends, then you don't have to do anything about it. Okay? Alright? So that does it answer your question? So those who... Um, who apparently cut and joined the video, please let me know so that I can check your presentation. If I think that this is too unfair for your friends, I will be asking you to redo it again. Okay. Alright. Thank you for the question. Okay. All right. So if you have um, questions, you can let me know. If not, you can leave and then start doing your first presentation. Let me stop sharing. Okay. So if you have any question, you can unmute your microphone just in case if I didn't notice or you can raise your hand here. All right. Thank you.
Okay, Zunwei. Bye-bye. Thank you. Bye. I'll be here until 12, okay? Mm, I Can I have the slide and share it on TV? Ladies and gentlemen, my name is Tachi, and one of the guys who is on the way to achieve his dream. Dream is not a kind of thing that can be achieved without any effort and action. So today I'm going to talk about how important it is to achieve dreams. I believe the dream is exciting for everyone of us here. We've been full of logging for the future since we were children. In those last years, we thought becoming a teacher, becoming a star, becoming a scientist, becoming a doctor. These are our best dreams, and we are all the way. Some of the spiritual forces in grow are those talk and hope that support us, and some motivation and expectation on this originally pumping root. So my dear classmate, even if we enter university, we must not forget our ideals. It cannot be worn away by time to imagine the future. Only by forming our inner explanation and learning can we be faster to achieve self and grow self. Only in the long years to come will we find the value and the meaning of our existence. That's why it's one of the reasons why we need to achieve our dream. I still remember an elder once said this to me. He said, if one day your dreams go out, then you may not see the way ahead. So every time I consume, I will think about whether my dreams are still there. Whenever I don't know what direction to go, I'll first find my dream because only by finding my dream can I go more rationally or in one direction to a brighter tomorrow. If you are confused the future in the future, please don't be afraid. The first thing you need to do is just find your own ideas. By knowing what kind of person do you want to be, can we go one way or another route? So the dream thing is very meaningful to us and it is also a thing that can provide us with endless power. So please church it is, cherry every woman you have a dream. And please take advantage of your dream while we are still young. And follow your ideals. Let our dream fly. Let this dream unfold in the most beautiful clear sky. Let our dream fly. Let the beautiful grow live this life forever. Ladies and gentlemen, are you ready at this moment? And for patience, for yearning, for every day in the future. Let us fly our dreams together and move toward tomorrow. Lastly, I hope to hear you my speed today. I will appreciate if you guys can give me some of your feedback or write one of your dreams on the paper to share it to me. I would love to hear the dreams of everyone of you. Thank you.